the heart of Scarborough Cliffcrest neighborhood, where memories weave themselves into the fabric of time, resides a remarkable couple, Mr. Gordon Hutchison and Mrs. Marion Hutchison. This is a lovely cozy house they have lived in for the last 65 years. They gave me a tour of their lovely house and showed me some of Marion's artwork and shared their memories. What's the very first one I ever did? Okay, so this is the oil paint by Marion. Marion, so... Uh, Could you please show me your other artworks? That is, that is also... They're all mine, yeah. Yeah. This, what? this was on the French River. French? And the man that was the cottages, he took the picture from up on the hill. Okay. Because we used to pull in here. But yeah. this part here was way around here was the French River. Okay. And Gord could only come up there carefully because the rocks, but he got to know where they were so he could bring his boat up. Okay. And we'd get off and get up on here and have a picnic. Oh, but I had, he sent me the picture. I think it's on the back. Yeah. No, it's fine. Yeah. Fine, fine, fine. Yeah. Oil paint as well, right? And I can see another this one. This is another one of her handiworks. Wow, that's three dimensional. Made of oh, three dimensional. It's, it's, oh. it's how many pictures? Five. Uh, five or six. Take five or one. six identical pictures, cut in different parts. They call it um, decoupage. Decoupage, but it's three dimensional decoupage. Yeah, yeah. Mostly yeah. decoupage. You just Doesn't cut it look it real? Yeah, it's look real. Yeah. yeah. But see, it's got a, a great or um, this color from being hung up so long in the bedroom in that's why a little bit discolored or yeah no, it, it yes. picked up that color okay yeah yeah that's it, good it was all gray and white that's my favorite <laughs> yeah that's very good and that, she yeah. has talent yeah still she has still i see she's doing knitting and everything you so want to see, you want to see the, the project for uh covid what is that which project do you have this oh this one you have done yeah this was i did for covid oh <laughs> I did it for Gord. Gord, how many pieces are in it? It took me a long time. My dad was quite good at it. He would do cartoons. He loved to do that. Mm -hmm. So I guess. When I, did you do that? This one? That be, be, between during this the beginning of, no, of COVID, and yeah. then I gave it to him last Christmas for a Christmas present. He thought I was doing it to put into the book, into the uh, blankets. Okay. Um, I donate, <laughs> but it was for him. My daughters, when they were in Girl Guides, I met a couple of ladies, and one of them, her husband, works as a, a salesman for men's suits. Yeah. And she said, I had all these samples. Oh, you made and from she, all she the says, samples. Yeah, she said, does anybody know <laughs> anybody that would take these samples? I said, yes, I'll take them. <laughs> so, oh, that's a good idea, in yeah, fact. It's all men's suiting. Yeah. So, you don't, I don't throw things out. <laughs> That's nice, and the back, yeah, the other that, side is also very nice. Yeah, it's that, well, I just used to find something that was the sort of boat, because he liked fishing. Yeah. <laughs> Mr. Gordon unfolded his old photo album and showed me his memories and photographs of his family members and friends. Why? And when the waves came in, yeah. you filled that up. And when the wave went out, you dropped right down to the ground, 15 feet down. Wow. And, and he did it, not me. <laughs> <laughs> I can't find it. I don't know where else it would be. No. There's me getting my ear cut off by a pirate. Marion loves various artwork. Here she is showing me some of her 3D papers art that she did. Oh, what do you call it? The place where people sold pictures okay. and the people had come to visit and sat, sat down there and, and watched it all. And these are 3D painting, right? 3D pictures. They're all paper. 3D pictures. Under there. Oh, they all are papers. Yeah, it's painter. Yeah. It was okay. Anton, Pe Anton Peake's pictures. So, how did you learn all this? I took classes. You took classes. There was yeah. a lady that taught it, and a friend of mine that took it uh, and with a different person. She did yeah. huge birds. Uh, yeah. Campbell's, the one above the fireplace. Yeah. Oh, the picture was huge. It was like yeah. this big. 
And oh, they were marvelous. Yeah, these are nice as well. The house is full of memories. Mr. Gordon showed me a beautiful gift that he received from his friends on their 25th marriage anniversary. Well, what is it about? You're, you're saying something. 25th, 25th, what's that say, 25 years anniversary. 25 years of your anniversary, right? Silver dollars. Those wow, are silver dollars. Silver 25, dollars. 25 silver dollars. Wow. Marion still preserves her mother's memory. In her bedroom, she still has a photograph of her beautiful mother. Your mother? Yes, and that was at a cottage. My mother never wore pants. And look at the way she was dressed at a cottage. Yeah. <laughs> her shoes were on and her dress. She just had to something she wore was pants, and that's Gory. And I, my sister. So you two, you two years here. Yeah. Oh. My, my dad came home from the services with um, nerve problems and had to take up some hobbies, so he started woodworking. And he decided that I should save pictures, so he made me this folder. There you okay. go. Yeah, yeah that, that's your dad, and let us yeah, have... Yeah, that was, he put that inside. Wow, 1946, yeah. wow. Yeah. And this was the size of the camera I had at the time, so you can't even see the pictures of what the people look like. <laughs> Yeah, but still you have some memories. Yes, I look at them every so often. Uh, okay. This is me in the middle of that one. So in the middle, yeah. This was this was my pen pals in Scotland okay. when I was in the Girl Guides. Okay. <laughs> oh, you can't see them. That was my class. That's your school days. <laughs> yes. Uh, <laughs> I think that was in when, Scotland or no? That was here. I that is here. Yes, in, I was in, in Scotland. In Toronto. Yeah. In Toronto. This is my cousin, and this yeah. was me. <laughs> oh, it, it's you, right here? Yeah. In Toronto? Yeah. Yeah. yeah down on Borden Street. Yeah. I live down. This is my mother, and I look oh. like I, I look like my mother. Wow. <laughs> and Gord's the same. He looked like his mother. Yeah. But my girls, the youngest one, looks like Gord. And this was Gord in front of his house. Oh. This was his veranda, but that was yes, that was his mother's house, I should say. Okay. And see what they did with this house? Yeah. It was exactly like this, an old, old house, and they took the whole front half of it and, okay. and made it flat. Re well, redid there the house. We yeah. There we go. But We're coming there, yeah. yeah. And that's me, but all dressed yeah. up. Yeah, <laughs> you see, okay, the pictures cool. are so crummy. Yeah. This was my um, first communion. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> and this was at my wedding. Oh, yes. <laughs> so it's you and uh, who my are mom and dad. Your mom and dad. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. There's my no. mom and dad. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Here? Right there. That's my mom and dad. Let me uh, just have a look. It's all my work because Gord <laughs> Okay. So you have organized all those things? Yeah. Wow. Okay. That would be Now there's picture. one in here. That's me on my horse. Oh, that's that's the horse you're talking about. Yes. Is it you on the horse? Yes. Wow. That's me up there. Yeah. Now, well, I had another picture of Marion and me, right there. Is there you and? That's yeah. that's us two before we were married. Okay. 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 Good. <laughs> And I got pictures in here of, there's me, the telephone company took that picture of me Okay. at the Grey Cup game, Okay. because we, when we were working, there, there's, now. This is a bell picnic. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but this is me and one of the guys, Two of my friends I worked with the first year I worked in the telephone company. So you're fine. we went to Mexico. Yeah. By bus. Whoa! Wow. By bus, four days and yeah. five nights it took us to get there. Yeah. By uh, by bus. But uh, I can still remember we stayed in the Majestic Hotel, and it was six dollars and seventy-five cents a night. Per night? Uh, per night, and yeah. that included three buffet meals. While showing me her house, I could feel that Marion got nostalgic. Memories of her childhood and young age 
popped into her mind and she showed me some old photos with great passion. You know, you know yeah. it's not flat, it's, it's rounded. Oh yeah. Glass. yeah. And I kept pr protecting it. I left it under a bed for years till I finally said, no, it better get fixed. <laughs> wow, very nice. But, yeah, I thought it was. And do you remember which year is that one? No, I wouldn't. They, they were still living out west on the farm, but see the way they were dressed, it must have been their Sunday clothes. Yeah. <laughs> but I was named after this one. Her name was Marion. Marion, yeah, yeah, okay. And uh, that was my mom's sister, Rose. And my uncle is, where is he? Uh, yeah. The lovely couple is blessed with two daughters and three grandchildren. The photographs are when they graduated. Yeah. In the middle. Oh, well, it's nice that... Well, the thread is just sticking on posts. Yeah. Easy to find out those stuff. Yeah. It's uh, your... Diane. Susie's kids, okay. Robert, Melissa, and Kaylee. And you know where the word Kaylee comes from? Oh, from there. Irish people, when they have a party in the kitchen, they call it a Kaylee. Okay. <laughs> and that's her husband thought that was a cute name. I asked my dad for a family tree one time. I thought he'd write me up a bunch of notes. Oh, he he did me a painting instead. Okay. His name's in there, but they're hard to see. Yeah. This was my dad's stepmother in the wheel in the wagon and his mother delivering fish. That's their business, they'd sell fish. In Scotland? Yeah. No, this was England, they were This from. England, yeah. And they were delivering it on their buggy with the horse. Oh, wow. <laughs> I don't so know how I inherited it, but I did, yeah. and I hung on to it. Ago, long ago. Yeah. It's hard to believe, isn't it, you hang on to things, then you think. And then this one, <laughs> another friend made This one? It. Yeah, up here. A this friend made it for me. This one? Yeah, and all that goes in it is wedding pictures. Wow, it's fancy. Yeah, yeah, very fancy. Yeah, and it just opens up and all the wedding pictures are... Oh, that's <laughs> nice. Isn't that something? Wow. And then thinks, well, who wants junk like that? <laughs> Me. But these are not junk. These are... Yeah, and up there is my first communion. This and one? my brother. Yeah, oh, that's me yeah. and my brother. Our first communions. And my dad took the picture and then cut it out and made a frame for it. <laughs> okay, and this, is, nice. this is done with macaroni. Yeah. Isn't that weird? <laughs> the letters. You see the ideas. Yeah. Oh, it's a good idea. Yeah. As we bid farewell to Mr. Gordon and Miss Marion, we live with a profound sense of admiration for the lives they have lived and the love they have shared. Life has been a beautiful journey for this couple. Dear viewers, Please join us as we embark on a journey through their lives, their stories and the cherished memories they have created.